This morning it was 1,150. Now tonight, well, look at that. It's up to 1,377. Now that's all within only 20 hours after her name appeared on our chart. I just want to know, Caitlin, how you do that thing you do. This is right? Alice Piazeki uh, signing it's off. It's a pleasure with to the give the question that is on everyone's Oh hi, mind. Alice. Alice, I'm here. Oh, yeah. Boy, it's been such a day here at debate camp. Quite a, uh, a cram session. You know, we've been out here chopping wood and um, hunting and fishing and bringing in the wild Alaskan game to feed all of the family valued families. Save that for the podcast. And that is why we cast our the podcast. Max, are we ready? Yeah. Oh boy, what is that? We are rolling. Is that Ellen DeGeneres? Oh, let me move. Let me move. I've always felt like a man. Hi. Is some of the boys? Oh, and girls and girls clobbered me in uh, a little bumper boat game of who's got the nuclear weapon. I lost my glasses. Can you believe it? Oh. We believe really that it's not about what you see. It's about what you think you see, just like Jesus. Yeah, I think actually I look a little better without my glasses. You know, <clears throat> but, uh... Hello, welcome to Alice in Lesbo Land. It's a bi-weekly podcast for bisexual and sapphically inclined ladies and their friends. <laughs> and we're coming to you live from the planet here in West Hollywood. I'm Alice Piazeki, and my guest today is Sarah Palin. She's a, a beautiful and, and accomplished senior, senior executive, head chancellor, princess extraordinaire of the great country of Alaska. And um, she's gonna tell us today about coming out. Coming out, coming out to support. One thing I've noticed, Alice, is that as I've been out there talking to the American people, there are certain choices that Americans make. My very best friend is a gay. I was doing my weekly censorship at the Wasilla Public Library. I saw this boy with a baby in his hands on the cover of this magazine that you may have heard of called People. It's a magazine about people, and that is just not the type of choice that I would make. The, the, the Les, Leslie Lohan the, and her friend, her friend in the hat, um, you know, they are innocent victims. And I think that there is never anything wrong with being good friends. I've had plenty of good friends in my life. I mean, if they say you're coming out, um, affair is usually the most unforgettable. Well, you know, Alice, one of the, one of the neat things about uh, Jesus and about the Judeo-Christian values is that, you know, you can repent for your sins. You can be born again. You can just get in that water and born again, just wash it all away. And that is something that I wanna really bring to the American people. I wanna get the witchcraft out of there. I wanna get the witchcraft out and I wanna get the homosexuality out. Not that I judge it. I don't judge it, and I know, I know the gotcha journalists are gonna spin that, but there's been a lot of talk in the media leak about foreign policy, Iraq, Iran, Afghanistan, Sweden. Alaska is a, is a, is a microcosm of America in the whole because, well, we also have homosexuals and foreigners. I don't, I know more homosexuals than I do foreigners. And that's, that's one of our policy changes. I'll give you something specific. We're gonna set up a national system to create a gay way. Our chart's for lesbians. I thought our chart was for everybody. Let me go crazy, crazy on you. No, no, it's not, it's just not something, uh, it's not something that Sarah Palin wants. I'll tell you that. You know, here's the thing. I know how to handle a gun. I know how to handle a gun. I've raised five children. Uh, I wrangle in a snowmobile every day. And um, 
ultimately I am ready for the office of the, pres the Vice Presidency of the United States of 